What are the odds of getting pregnant after a vasectomy? Well, let's look at all the different forms of birth control so we can compare. So the failure rate for condoms is 10%. The failure rate for birth control pills is 7%. The failure rate for tubal ligation, or what we call tubes tied, is 0.5%. And for vasectomy, it's less than 2%. Now, yes, you could say, well, getting your tubes ties is more effective. However, it's major surgery. For a woman to have her tubes tied, it requires general anesthesia, laparoscopy, and it's a pretty big deal. Even though it's a simple surgery, it is a surgery. On the other hand, vasectomy is actually quite simple to do, especially in experienced hands. It takes 10 to 15 minutes. It, re it requires local anesthesia, which works very well. The patient can literally drive themselves home if they choose to do so. Their activity is not very limited for the first week, unlike surgery where you really have to take it easy. And they can go to work pretty much the next day. So if you're looking for a safe, effective form of birth control, the way to go is vasectomy. If you're interested in hearing more from me, please follow me. I have more videos coming.